do you need help or do you need help with getting a message across? Maybe just a little bit. So guys, we're going to start a SB7 spirit box. Can you hear that? Yeah. Let me know in the comment guys who guys heard that part. What do you need help with? Do you need help with getting a message across? Maybe just a little bit. Yeah. Let me know in the comment guys who guys heard that part. generated spirits can use it to manipulate it. If you guys watch the Palmyra video, you can see the difference between the bleed through your human now and through your responses. Did I say Christy? Christy? You heard Christy, right? There's something definitely trying to talk between. So our group name is Paranormal of Watertown. And we're joined with Rochelle G. And we're here to try to communicate with you. All the devices we have in our hand here are just to record it, to document it. And if you have any message that you want to give to anybody, that's why we're recording it. That's why we're trying to get a message out. Because I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. That's what we're trying to document. We're trying to prove to people that your soul or your spirit is still here. Is that okay with you if we do that? If the connection is choppy, make sure you follow us on YouTube. That's why I always plug our YouTube channel because you know we're not going to get a choppy video. That was a good laugh. Yeah, it was a laugh, right? Something like that. What? <laughs> what did that say? It's a laugh. The little kid said laugh. Oh, so I laughed. Yeah. Laugh. yeah. Something that was cool. cool. We heard that. Laugh. Thank laugh. you. <laughs> Number four is the inspection. Right there. So again, um, an earlier question was, do we trust apps? This is one app that we have used multiple times, the Hack Shack X8. And I, I don't have, have any, yeah, I don't have any reason to believe that. It's not because this, I've run this for almost two hours in my house and got absolutely nothing the whole time. 
Are you able to communicate with us through this one? I will touch that antenna. That's a, what we call a REM pod. It will let us know that you're close to it. Any of those light up balls you can touch. The lights will go off. It will just simply make us aware that you are here. You guys, just for um, reference, we've been in this room about half an hour now. And these light up balls and REM pod has not gone off at all. So if they do start going off, it's, our foot stops obviously aren't really making them go off at all. Yeah. You heard that footstep right behind you, right? Yes, were you moving? No, I thought it was you. But then I looked you. and you were right there. It sounded like it was right in this hallway. That was, that was weird. Sneaking up behind us? It's okay. I mean, these floors are creaky, but it sounded like something was... It sounded like that, yep. right there. You hear that? Where did I just step? Right there. It sounded like someone was stepping right here. I actually thought Patty was coming through. Right there. You hear that? Was that you that we heard? No, yeah, right here. That's loud. Mm. I'll play that back in the camera within three minutes. Right there. You just see this step right here? Yeah, I'm gonna stand still. I'm here. I'm here. That's oh, it, I'm shit. here. <laughs> I'm telling you, I hear I'm hearing footsteps over there. Do you wanna put the REM pod over there? Yeah. For a minute? <laughs> I got cold chills. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> I just said I was here. quiet for like, what, five minutes? This is the shit out of me. What the? This is the pink holes on my back. <laughs> I was getting tired. It closed on your back? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did you bump into it? I don't think so. <laughs> it's like your desk. It's going to take you over the whole time. <laughs> wow, okay. There we go. <laughs> this is where I was close. sitting. This thing just closed on my back. <laughs> Are you behind Christy? I did say Christy over here. This is wide angle, so you should be in it. So if I can see that fall behind you, I'll be able to let you know. Because okay. this is running so. Let me know if you guys in the comments heard that spear box say, I'm here right after. I swear, I'm hearing footsteps. I mean, I know it's creaky right here, but I'm hearing it distinctly out there. Terry heard I'm here. So of course said I'm here too. Can you tell me who we're speaking with? Or can you walk back into this into this room and make that light go off behind me? Touch that antenna. Guys, how's the connection? Because it seems to be you. pretty good right now. I it doesn't hurt. It just lights up. You gotta get real close to it though. That way we know you're here. We did hear the footsteps, though. That was pretty cool. Terry said you could hear the footsteps on the lives. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, because I looked at you, I'm like, you're I here, you. I know I'm here. Yeah. Everyone else is in the room. I'm yeah. shifty over here, but it's not going to Guys, let me way. show you where Patty is. I'll show you how far away she is. Because our guide is all the way over here. So Patty, I'm showing our viewers how far away you are, because <laughs> we heard footsteps. And I haven't moved. Yeah, we yeah. heard footsteps, and then the spirit box says, I'm here. <laughs> I was looking at Rochelle, because I thought she was moving. She's looking at me, I'm like, mm -hmm. you heard footsteps right behind, because that's one of the claims, correct, is footsteps. Yep, yeah, and I would and so you... announce if I'm coming into okay. the room. Yeah, so that's awesome. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we definitely heard, and 
we, the only thing I'm doing in here is coughing a little yeah. bit, but <laughs> other I haven't moved from this spot because I don't want to taint your guys' yeah. investigation. No, we appreciate it. We're getting some responses all through the spear box. So. I heard that. I heard that it's some yeah. laughing and some yeah. other stuff. So that's pretty cool. Oh, what was, was there a little boy? Did you guys get a little boy's name at all through previous investigations? We got something that sounded like Danny or something. No. Something with a Y, so we had to replay it. Yeah, because the um, the only one that we know of for sure that lived here and had died was Charles, and that Charles. was Elvira and her, and her husband John's son. Yeah, Elvira. And he, and he died in 19, 1860, and he okay. was like 20. Okay. So he wasn't really... He wasn't a young child. Okay. No, and the, the daughter... Who died in the same year? Two months, two months later, she was like thirteen or fourteen. Okay. But nope, that was not me. Never. I was not moved. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna end this record. Oh, oh God, this is antique. <laughs> yeah, it's only good at life. <laughs> it still got me. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna stop this recording. We're gonna do a straight EVP session. Okay, so everyone's outside. Christy's inside taking pictures. Patty's in the main room there sitting down. Is Corey outside too? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so it's literally just me and Christy investigating in here. Christy's taking pictures. Patty, our guide, is up sitting in the main room. If there's a message that you want to give me or anyone you can speak into this recorder Stairs are very creaky. Is there anyone still here that wants to say something to a loved one? Who's that little boy that we heard laughing downstairs? And obviously inanimate objects will be gray on a thermal camera. It's nighttime. Every dress in the room is gray except for that one, and that one is blue. And we're playing. We don't know why, because these aren't crystals. These are just little pieces of plastic. And obviously, inanimate objects will be gray on a thermal camera. It's nighttime. Every dress in the room is gray except for that one, and that one is blue. And we're playing. And we're playing. So final eight, we are kind of conducting a session right here at the stairwell. This is where we got the EVP that just said hide. This is where an investigator prior to our team being here felt like something rushed down the stairs. 
as if they're playing hide and seek and running. Does someone like to play hide and seek? Are there children still here? Something. Can you come down these stairs and make one of those devices light up? That's how we know where you are. If you like to play hide and seek, I'll come. I'm here. I'm here. I'm gonna count and then you run and hide, okay? If you're down here, run upstairs. I'm gonna count to ten. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What? Oh yeah. I can play as right before three minutes. It sounds like they would respond if they need finishing calling down. Let's play or something. Did you hear that? No, I just another thumb. Almost like something was right up there. Let's play or something. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It sounded like something was just coming down those stairs. That was a big thump. I, I wasn't moving. No, you weren't. You didn't bump in anything. No. Between three minutes and three and a half minutes is that thump. You'll hear it on there. That was loud. Is there someone upstairs? Christy made a friend. I'm not very happy about it. It's okay. It's okay. It's oh, yeah, you're not a cat person, either. I know that. That's why it's right. Let's see. <laughs> can, you, can you tell us the name of the cat? What is it? Oh, my God. Did that just say Maisie? Yeah. Of course, I will. Oh, it really likes me. <laughs> Thank you. You're absolutely right. What is it? Can you, can you say one of our names? Okay. <laughs> Maisie? Who is Maisie sitting with? Yeah, he's very faint, but I hate it. Who is Maisie sitting with? 